I did no vlog before. I told y'all I was gonna be posting on the YouTube trying to get these motherfucking shoes on, bro. <laughs> your boy, your boy ended up scoring, scoring on the Kobe joints. That's what we picking up. It's about 12 o'clock right now. I'm, I wake up late. I just got up. I'm good, though. I'm finna go pick up these Kobe's, man. Probably do a little side missions on the side. Bet y'all know how I get now. I'm just finna pick these up, though. Hey, I do remember these boys coming out back in the day. They sat like a motherfucker, but your boy was broke. Shit. I got, I got, I got motion now. Definitely ain't missing out on no more Kobe's that I wanted. That's getting retro. I'm actually... I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, besides the GGs, I ain't get the GGs. I'm like, I'm like, I really only wanted the Grinches, to be honest. I scored on them retail. That's about it. But yeah, these Venice Beaches definitely been on that radar. I'm trying to get these motherfucking Air Bacons on. Yeah, let's check, you know. We'll say this, you have a cop. You know, I like older shit, too. Definitely go up probably half a size on these. They fit, but. A little narrow, a little narrow, but yeah, feature. I'm gonna probably deliver these packages too on my way out. Everybody always asks me, What do you do for a living? Uh, I restore shoes four times. I have like maybe like seven, eight sources of income. Um, restoring for people all around the world. Uh, they ship me shoes, all type of shit, but I love to do them locally though. <laughs> When I do them, when I do them out of state, it'd be like, ah, damn. But, you know, I've been doing it for a long time. I know how this routine go. Two big-ass packages got to go wherever they go. I'm going to do that first, then, you know, chop it up with y'all in the car. God damn, my boy. I got a long-ass drive. <laughs> hey, though, I'm going to give y'all some sauce, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I ain't going to lie, though. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a beautiful day in Chicago right now, though. For, you know what that means. Yeah, I'm in the trenches with it. What's this? 83rd. 83rd and Loomis. Definitely in the trenches with it. But I say this though. You know what a sunny day means in Chicago? A rain of bullets. I can see it now. It's probably the hottest day we had in a little minute too. But hey, y'all be safe out there. I ain't got time. Oh, uh, just trying to pick these shoes. I'm a homebody. Stay my ass in the crib. I'm about to, I'm about to definitely give out some sauce, though. I know y'all seen that long-ass drive I got to take. Like, I ain't going to front. That Foot Locker Challenge, what was it, Foot, foot Action app? Bro, I'm talking about I had over a million-plus points and everything. Ain't shit was working until somebody, until somebody gave me the sauce, though. And, I, this, and this probably work. It might not work for everybody. You definitely gotta have a bunch of uh, you definitely gotta have a bunch of uh, foot locker locations and shoe locations, whatever the case may be. But this this is some good advice for, for people in Chicago. I'm finna I'm finna give out the sauce. I'm I'm low key, I'm low key tripping. But that's how I've been winning all my raffles though, because I used to be losing every single. Bro, couldn't stand that fucking out, bro. But now I found the sauce. All it is, you got to pick the furthest location. Simple as that. You ain't got to pick, like, I think the furthest, well, from, like, the Chicago area, I think the furthest you can go on my thing is, say, Milwaukee. I ain't going to no Milwaukee, but I go to the suburbs of Chicago. I mean, the suburbs of Illinois, whatever you want to call it, but Schaumburg and Aurora and shit, I'll make that drive. That's like an hour. Anything you gotta do for the kicks, man. You know how it is. Uh, my thing is, I always used to pick like, I always used to pick uh, like the closest location down the street. Cause in Chicago, it is when you live in a big ass city, bro. It's a, it's, it's, it's we probably got a thousand damn Foot Lockers and Champs and all the stores that got raffles and shit. Like, of course you gonna pick the closest one. I ain't know no better shit. I ain't gonna even front. Like I was, I was, I was picking the one down the street and shit. But my homie like, nah, fo, you gotta, you gotta pick the furthest ones. I'm like, what? I'm like, who wanna make that long ass drive? He said, bro, I've been scoring every release, big release you can name in the past. How long this app been out? And hey, I I, I took that advice. 
Nigga been winning every time. Every time. I probably had like two. I'm probably like a hundred and old. I ain't going to say 100, though. I'm going to say like a, I'm going to say like 102 in the last 100 releases. Shit. <laughs> but real shit, they, they, that, that's definitely the sauce, though. I just gave y'all the sauce, especially for my Chicago people that be watching me and shit. But if you, if you, you got to have wheels. You got to have some wheels. <laughs> if you got no wheels, don't need sign up. Test your luck in the city. But if you got wheels, you got motion, you got, you got somewhere to go. You feel me? You can get up and get about this motherfucker. Definitely take that hour, 45 minute drive out the city. And you definitely gonna get the dub every time. Every time. It's definitely nice in Chicago, so, but. Damn, for they got me going towards West. I knew that already. It's like, air town, I come West. If you from South, if you live South or East of Chicago, bro, I'm, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a East side of folk. But I live south, folks. Oh, going 290, gonna always be fucking traffic, bro. Like, can't stand it. You, for the people that don't know, bro, Chicago and like Chicago, Chicago South and West got like a fake beef. It ain't real beef. It's like it's wherever you from, wherever you represent. We always clown each other on the internet. I mean, Hey, they say you old if you on Facebook. I don't get no fuck. We be on Chicago. Be on Facebook. I don't get no fuck. Yeah, we got like an ongoing beef, man. Look, they say, we always say, if you from South, out West dirty, they feel the same, they feel the same way about us. <laughs> they feel the same way about us. I can't find, but I hate coming out here. Ain't shit. Hey, I don't find nothing amusing about this fucking traffic. It's always fucking traffic. And it's during the day, for It's like one o'clock. Like, it shouldn't even be traffic. Motherfuckers should be at work, but can't stand coming out to to 290 towards our west. That shit irritating. I ain't even on the I ain't even on 290 yet. I'm just going towards west. It's always traffic though. So if you ever come to Chicago, best believe you're gonna have to deal with this shit every fucking time you go go towards west. He's definitely here though. You know you find the birds when you wanna see the pink so I the pink people. Let me go on and get these shoes like equipment. I might do some side missions on that bitch. I don't know. Probably record, see what they got. I ain't been to the mall. Bought some shoes in the mall in forever. But we'll see. I had to do a voiceover in the inside because I just know they was going to mute the shit out this music and I ain't finna get paid. But yeah, they had a bunch of AEs sitting. This is my first time seeing the All Star joints in person and fire. I don't really like these solid color ones like that, but they solid at the same time. These Kobe's was fire. Uh, I need these white and black ones, OG. I'm a big Kobe guy. The black and white ones, I can really pass on them, but the white and black ones got to come home soon. Uh, I'm so glad this dunk wave over with, bro. Like, Jesus Christ. I remember motherfuckers reselling them for 250 and shit. Crazy. I seen these ones. They was solid, but 135 for Air Force Ones, bro, is crazy, bro. Uh, these was like 115. The other ones, these right here, about 115. But still, that's crazy. This used to be the go-to. Now, they raise the price for ones. It's, it's crazy. Look at all the Jordans sitting. Oh, man, this is just the perfect time to, like, get into shoes. If you into the buyer's market right now, man, everything sitting. Everything is below retail. If you see it in the store, it's likely online for cheaper. Hey, I, I don't give a fuck what you say. I fuck with the Spice. Uh, they had the uh, Powder Blue sitting. Y'all tried to hype these up, Fear 3s. I feel like they was never all that. I'm going to keep it a bean with these tools. Uh, what I always tell y'all, tools always belong at the outlet. But I love Jordan tools, but just not those. These are solid. People was trying to get them so much flack. That's a solid-ass shoe. Uh, they got a couple of uh, uh, Migo mics. These Olive Fives. I got to cop these, but 225 Stop it. That's too damn high. But they solid, though. Uh, they had, they had uh, a couple more shit over here. These Jordan One, these Jordan One, so solid. They solid. My first time seeing them in person, but I got so many yellow shoes. They've been dropping too many yellow Jordans in the last what fucking like three years. But I don't need another yellow Jordan, especially not no Jordan Ones. I don't bought too many Jordan Ones. Uh, Bigo Mike. Oh Lord, I don't even know why I picked them up. I thought they were something else, Oreos or something like that. But yeah, them them definitely had a lot of joy sitting though. And then I went to the Nike basketball section. Uh, the Josh Solid, folks. These are a little childish. I ain't gonna even sit here and cap. But 
they 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 solid. I like this colorway too. I feel like you could throw them on with some little joggers or some some chill. You feel me? The KD sixteen. I don't like this colorway, but I do love the model. Man, they grow on me. Not gonna even cap. They had the KD sixteen wanders. I don't like that tongue. That tongue is crazy. I was like a waffle or some shit. I don't know. But the KD three. Uh, these still sitting in here. I'm surprised y'all hoopers ain't pick one of these up. Uh. I only like the Unpearl colorway. I wasn't a big fan of KD3s. Uh, Mo Jaws. I ain't never seen none of these Jaw colorways. I'm going to keep it a being. Never seen none of them. Uh, even green ones were solid. I mean, they're all right. Uh, Jaw had a lot of releases. Underrated for sure. These were solid. I like these probably the most. Uh, another Nike basketball section. Pretty much a lot of GT hustles. I seen the books. The books in person, bro. The flack that y'all get this shoe. I know I. I said a lot about the books, but the books in person are pretty solid. I don't think they worth the price, but the books are solid. Oh, my granny, bro. I will cop these. I will wear these. A lot of people get these flack. Decent quality shoe. The suede ain't really super suede, but the shoe look decent. I would definitely wear them casually. I'm not trying to hear none of that. Man, they just teasing us with the Tim Duncan jerseys. It's supposed to be like a hybrid with the new basketball shoes and the Tim Duncan thesis disgusting uh matter of fact get these out my motherfucking face disrespectful to tim duncan the total phone positive max need to release look it up if you don't know what shoe that is ben post being retro <sighs> is that at the point the bag is secured the bag is definitely secured uh i might do some sad missions out here i don't know yet since i'm out in the burbs you might you got you dan i gotta check out I'm, the, the thrift in me want to go check I might go see. I'm definitely about to probably go check. I ain't gonna lie. But I'm gonna do a review when I get to the crib. I might record some thrift footage too. Uh, Y'all might see that. Might not. But definitely gonna do a review when I get to the crib. I ain't gonna even try to. I, 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 def, I, def, I definitely found one. I'm definitely about to head to that one. I gotta, I gotta do at least one. At least one, people. At least one thrift. <laughs> Really ain't no secret, folks. You gotta hit the burbs, folks. You want some good shit? Let's see what they got, though. I ain't gonna even say in front of this bitch. Right. Hey, let me go ahead and do this review for y'all, man. I'm gonna head to Korea. <laughs> Very clean, very clean, very clean, very clean. I ain't gonna lie though. Like I mean, even though I've, we've seen a million pictures of these, it definitely like a tie dye look. Some people might not like these. These actually might be lower than what I expect them on the aftermarket. Uh, I like them. These probably one of them shoes you wear a few times in the summertime. Definitely a summer shoe. No, I don't I don't see myself definitely rocking these every day. Or hooping in them. I ain't trying to hear none of that. Oh, you should have. This is who we lose the raffles to. All that shit. I don't care. Uh, yes, I'm the nigga you lose the raffle to. Uh, they solid, though. They definitely solid. Uh, this is probably the best part right here. This is ain't nothing like a fresh icy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm too crazy, y'all. Like, I'm pretty sure y'all didn't see this shoe all over the internet. I ain't really got to preach too much about it. Uh, let me know in the comments, man, if you got lucky on any Kobe's today. This is the only one that I felt like that was, I would say, the hit of the month. April drops is looking kind of shitty. That's just me. Uh, besides the shock drop and these, I'm pretty much done with April unless I get another eBay steal or something like that. But overall, I'm pretty happy. Pricey as hell. Like I said, I remember these going on sale back in the day. I, dropping 200 on these is crazy. I'm not going to even lie. But... It is what it is. Let me know in the comments if you hit, pass, you don't care, etc. It's a cop for me, obviously, but I can see a lot of people kind of not getting these. I'm not going to even lie. So let me know some. My God. When I say. 
My feet is screaming right now. Screaming, bro. Screaming. If, if you can go up a whole size, bro, do it. I normally wear a size seven and a half, eight. Bro, I think I need an eight and a half. Like, don't get me wrong, I don't rock these bitches, but golly, I'm sorry, I want shit, these, these are just tight, they ain't tight, 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 I feel like you need to break them in, or you probably gotta get a hoop session in, you know, damn well, I ain't doing that, I might, need, I might need to do a jog in these motherfuckers, boy, but they fire, though, I know y'all gonna try to crack on my big ass socks on, bro, I ain't even tripping, though, they fire, though, yeah, definitely go up a size though for sure. Definitely go up a size. No bullshit. 